School is back in session this week in Colleton County, but parents are raising concerns about changes this year, including the use of virtual teachers. This is Jordan Sayopa in Walterboro hearing from some concerned parents. Parents in the Colleton County School District say they have some questions about new changes this year, including virtual teachers and the dress code. Now they're hoping to have their voices heard. Students are back in the classroom at the Colleton County School District, but many teachers are not. I'm just wondering when things are going to be able to change for everybody to get a fair education. Jenny Bumgarner's third grader is being taught by a virtual teacher this year. The district says they have 295 teachers, but they're still working to fill vacancies. According to the superintendent, they've hired a company to help with the shortage through the use of virtual teachers. The virtual part is concerning to me because we have some classes that are in person, you know, one on one teachers and stuff, but we have all these other virtual for the same class, you know, grade or level. Baumgartner isn't the only one skeptical about the virtual learning. Other parents and even their students have concerns. My kids have a very big voice about it. Like they don't like it because I mean, when we had COVID and they had to do virtual, it was very hard for them to do it. CCSD's new dress code is also facing pushback from parents. Of the new changes, shirts, sweaters and crew neck sweatshirts must be solid white or approved colors. This made for an expensive back to school shopping trip for Angela Gator. I spent it was close to $1,000. And I did not, honestly, I didn't have it, but I mean, what else am I supposed to do? Bumgarner hopes by attending school board meetings, she and other parents will have their voices heard. If we band together and start showing up to these, maybe they'll start listening. News 2 recently sat down with the CCSD superintendent to talk all about the start of the school year. You can find that interview on our website, countonto.com. Reporting in Walterboro, I'm Jordan Sayopa, Count on 2. And this just into the Count on Two newsroom, the Colleton County School District is responding to some of these concerns regarding virtual teachers. Their new statement reads in part, quote, the decision to assign virtual teachers was made out of necessity in response to the teacher shortages plaguing school districts throughout the United States. The Colleton County School District remains committed to recruiting and hiring in-person teachers to fill every classroom, end quote. You can find a full statement on our website, countonto.com. And now we're going to find out more.